Hello, I'm Cheryl Hernandez, the Executive Director at the Kenosha Literacy Council. We're proud to be one of the hosts of the African American Read-In each year. Uh, this year, the African American Read-In will be on Saturday, February 4th at 1 p.m. at the Kenosha Public Museum, and we hope to see you there for a great afternoon celebrating literacy and African American authors. I'd like to share this wonderful book with you today. It's called Change Sings by Amanda Gorman. I can hear change humming its loudest, proudest song. I don't fear change coming, and so I sing along. I scream with the skies of red and blue streamers. I dream with the cries of tried and true dreamers. I'm a chant that rises and rings. There is hope where my change sings. Though some don't understand it, those windmills of mysteries, I sing with all the planet and its hills of histories. I hum with a hundred hearts, each of us lifting a hand. I use my strengths and my smarts to take a knee to make a stand. I'm bright as the light each day brings. There is love where my change sings. I show others tolerance, though it might, make some, might take some courage. I don't make a taller fence, but I fight to build a better bridge. I talk not only of distances from where and how we came. I also walk our differences to show we are the same. I'm a movement that roars and springs. There's a wave where my change sings. Change sings where? There, inside me, because I'm the change I want to see. As I grow, it grows like seeds. I'm just what this world needs. I'm the voice where freedom rings. You're the love your bright heart brings. We are the waves starting to spring, for we are the change we sing. We are what the world is becoming, and we know it won't be long. We all hear change strumming. Won't you sing along? I hope you'll join us on Saturday, February 4th at 1 p.m. at the Kenosha Public Museum for the African American Read-In. Thank you.